Good afternoon everybody. Uh, we are working uh, in this moment on uh, this work uh, model of augmented reality and pedestrian navigation about the territorial heritage uh, design, implementation, and evaluation. My tutor is Jose Manuel Garcia de Mejo Giner. Uh, he's a professor in Faculta de Ciencias de la Universidad de Salamanca. Well, how born this project? By basically for two elements. First of all, we find recent advances in technological development of mobile devices, tablets, and uh, smartphones, make possible the use of new learning environments, particularly the mobile learning or M learning. In in parallel, we look, we are understanding the ubiquitous learning. It's the same since now the model system can create models and digital representation of the territory and its features, creating graphics, user interface adequate to situated learning in a special context with particular meanings and fact situations. Another, uh, another thing is very important. User learning can search and download any materials on his or her mobile device without time and space limitations. And uh, what more importantly, it would exist a relationship between the learner and the actual territory context, getting better results in the process learning. In this work, uh, the concepts about augmenting reality mobile and pedestrian navigation system and uh, situated learning and model learning are focused. We work with two big dimensions and, and objects of work. First of all, uh, we divide the objects in, te in technology, technological context and we work um, with objects in a pedagogy uh, pedagog pedagogical context. Uh, objects and technologic, technological context. First of all, the research aims to analyze the main tools used in the de development of security learning by PNSIR software in order to have a diagnosis of the existing software. We are developing a PNSIR software through the frameworks of location, navigation, and augmented reality your system allowing the presentation of content on heritage and territory, particularly in this case the Salamanca City. Uh, the context of the situated learning and mobile technology. Here we are to establish the process of building on PNSIR module using the architectural and technological context encapsulated by programming and customizable EO system and these development frameworks. For the other hand, we are studying and analyzing previous research and developments in terms of the relationship between a PNS RR and situated data and model learning and ubiquitous learning. Also, we are to define the influence of and effectiveness of PNS and RR software we created in the context of situated learning through a concrete example of the territory and cultural heritage, in this case, Salamanca City. Finally, we want to identify and understand the experience gained by users with a PNS uh, AR development software, where we identify the relevant issues and resulting key factors. What is the theoretical frame? Basically, four theoretical concepts. Theoretical and technical concepts. Augmented reality about territory, spatial heritage, history, geography, cultural issues about the Salamanca City. Mobile pedestrian navigation system, situation in re related between <coughs> user and mobile device related and final navigation method behind uh, GPS and other sensors of the, the hardware. And theoretical framework is a uh, situated learning in process of mobile learning uh, and learning. 
um, what is the methodology and research development? In the first uh, phase, we are development and implementation of PNS and air solvent phase. We are working now in EOS uh, X code is 6.0.1. And we are uh, choose uh, some uh, platform like uh, tablet, iPad, or, or mobile system, a smartphone like uh, iPhone. Uh, in parallel, we are collection of supplementary sources, study documentation, experience, 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 and generated the theoretical basis. And in the future, we are designing and implementation the evaluation tool in the system mobile and making analysis direct to the sample of the people who, who use the mobile system. Uh, finally, we are process and analysis the collected data, statistical, uh, quality analysis, etc. What we hope. Conclusion and spectral results. First, we will develop a customizable software under the modular structure and the arts of mobility, navigation, and virtual integration, ENS AL. <coughs> Another thing, this will have resulting benefits in the development and of improvements and optimization according to the progress and requirement as tool for an informal learning environment. Digital mapping, spatial location, and the territorial, territorial research information. Um, we are to obtain a tool with uh, greater effectiveness in the field of the heritage education compared to similar methodologies and usual tools. This research has a strong emphasis in technological aspect and the logical elements allow a continuous improvement of each element involved in the PNS IR system. And finally, the personalization of content and process in areas such as PNS and territorial heritage with twenty stations allows an uh, improvement in the learning process and the incorporation of cultural identity locally. Thank you very much for your attention.